What's up today everyone? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Zach and today we are starting a Minecraft series here on the channel. And as you can see, I'm not at the very beginning. And that's because I'm going back and adding this. I've decided I want to do a giveaway to celebrate our one year of doing YouTube. And yeah, so if you comment on this video, you will be entered to win some gaming items probably like a GameStop gift card along with some falling cat gaming merch like some stickers and a gaming accessory I would call it to go along with the falling cat theme so that's what you get if you enter this one I'm also doing it on our magic video that comes out Friday and in that one, I will be giving away a your choice of one of the new commander decks that go with Midnight Hunt and some Fallen Cat dice and uh, maybe some other stuff. I'm not really sure yet, but if I get a lot of engagement in both videos, I will do both giveaways. If just one gets a lot, then we'll do just that one. So all you gotta do to enter is be subscribed to the channel like and comment on the video and i would recommend following me on one of my other social medias either instagram or facebook or twitter just so i have an easier way to reach out to you if you win so i can reach out to you find out which thing you want and where i'm sending it to sadly it will only be available for us peoples because shipping internationally is hard and expensive so yeah all that being said i'm gonna go ahead and get back to the start of our minecraft series and enjoy the video thanks guys what's up today everyone welcome back to the channel my name is zach and today we are back with something new we are starting minecraft i've never actually played through it all the way Normally I get distracted and end up in creative and kind of just building stuff. That's kind of my thing. I just like making things in this, this world. But I am very curious to actually play through it on survival. Um, I'm not a complete noob at Minecraft. I do have a little bit of experience. But I've, like I said, I have usually don't do it the legitimate way most of the time. I either just, you know, find it in the world or find something close to it and then it's like, eh, that's close enough. I'll just grab the real thing in, in creative. And that's kind of how I've always played it. But for this, I want us to stay in survival the whole time and we're on hard difficulty. I do vaguely know the world a little bit. I tried starting recording this earlier, but for some reason it was really laggy. So uh, we're on the same seed as last time, and that is Outpost Ahead or whatever. I am playing on the Pocket Edition or Bedrock or whatever, uh, mainly because I don't remember how to get into my old Mojang account. So I can't get like regular Minecraft back on my computer. It's not a big deal to me. If you all really like this series, maybe we'll get it back and see about some mods or something. But our game plan for this series is to beat the game, build something awesome, and kind of just experience the world, right? That's at least what I have planned. I think at the moment, though, we're going to start off how I usually start off, which is finding a village to mooch off of. And like I said, I have a little bit of experience, and I know there is a village across the waters right ahead of us. So that's where we're going to be going. There is a pillager outpost right next to that. And so we will battle them as soon as we get any kind of gear. But yeah, um, I am pretty excited for this. I've been playing Minecraft a lot recently. My nephew has been really enjoying it. Me and him will always kind of play some game together. It was Fortnite and then now it has turned into Minecraft. Did I not? Why did I make that? I need these, dummy. There you go. Yeah, it was Fortnite. Now it's Minecraft. And yeah, I've been like I said, I just I've been having fun with it. You know, nothing, 
nothing too amazing or anything. It's not stressful. Uh, my thing with Minecraft though is, is I have to have like a goal or something, you know, to to be working on, or I just don't find it entertaining for some reason. I lose interest in it quickly. We do need a boat to get across. We'll take a pickaxe. Uh, we need a. We probably do. We need a regular axe. I don't think so. Not right now. We'll take a sword just in case we need to protect ourselves. Let's pick up our workbench. And why did that? It doesn't like my recording thing. It's laggy for some. Okay, there we go. So yeah, right over there is the outpost, as you all can see. Um, so pop the boat in, hop in, and let's get going. My skin is awesome. I was looking in the marketplace, just kind of seeing if there was any texture packs or anything I wanted to do. And not really. The thing I was most interested in uh, looked like it changed up Minecraft quite a bit. It was the nin ninja mashup one, right? I just love like the, the Japanese style stuff. It looks amazing and seems like it would be really cool. But I felt like it took a little too far away from Minecraft for a first little step into it. And so I ended up seeing a texture pack, or not texture pack, a skin pack that gave me Sasuke. And so I am playing as Sasuke. I will show you guys in a second as soon as we uh, roll up here. Oh god. Someone needs to fix your thing. But yeah, boom. He looks kind of dumb on the black background. But yeah. I am super excited that this is a thing I can have. One of these piles here. And this is going to be mine now. And I'll uh, turn that into food in a minute. So now we're going to call dibs on a house. I'm going to steal your bed, buddy. I'm sorry. Um, What house we want? I did see that house up on the hill when we were, were rolling over. So maybe, maybe we'll take that one. If I can figure out how to get up here easily. Come on. Parkour, please. Thank you. Boom. Boom. But yeah, I have no idea how some stuff in Minecraft works. Like, enchanting, never really got a hand of it. Uh, normally, I just take books that I find from either, you know, stealing from villagers or something like that, right? But I know you can make enchanting books, and I think what you get to random. I could be wrong. Correct me if I am. Uh, but yeah, I think you get them, get it randomized, right? And if that's the case, uh, we're going to have to see how good my luck is. Because uh, I'm horrible with that kind of thing. Ooh, box. Thank you. Gimme, 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 gimme. Okay, so nothing amazing. We will steal the chest. Oh my god. It's going to take two days to break. Gimme. Okay, what else is up here? Some radishes. We'll just leave those for the moment. Uh, a smithing table, right? I have great table. Same thing. It's the smithing bench, right? And weirdness. A weird little waterfall. Oh, wait. Is there a house over here? Why is there a house being attacked by a waterfall? Um, I mean, I think we're going to have to call dibs on this one, right? Like, it's just so weird. Um... And we have a dock for our boat. Perfect. We go. We'll just pop our boat right here, and we can we can call this one home. We even have a little elevator up. Awesome. This will be perfect. Where's my bed? Give me my bed back. I guess we should put on some kind of armor. We will put our bed right there. We will put our where's our chest? Put our crafting table here. Our chest we got up top. Can we make another one? A thingy. Uh, give me all my wheat. One of the other things I do a lot of in Minecraft is I'll just mine for days. So uh, if if we get mining too much, yell at me, okay? Because I will go down into a, a mine and just spend a freaking week of Minecraft time in there and never come out. Just dig out the whole universe. And yeah, that's that's just one of the ah, don't squish me. I also know of the the whole don't dig straight down rule, but uh, I don't generally follow it. 
at least not if I think there's a good chance there's no lava there. If there's, you know, if there's a possibility there's lava under me, I won't dig straight down. But if I'm like, you know, it'll be fine. Or if I'm not worried about dying, that's another thing. Let's, let's head to bed and then wait until day two. Oh, hey buddy. I see you there. You wanna, you wanna die? Come on, get him. Boom. Ooh, a helmet that is awesome. Give me, what's it do? Unbreaking. That's fine. I'll take a gold helmet. Nothing, nothing too spectacular. There is more coal. I love coal. I don't know why, but that's like one of the things I will, I will hoard forever in Minecraft. But, you know, maybe I'm crazy. You just, you always need it. I will take coal blocks for days. Give them to me. And pop them in furnaces. And I'll also just take iron forever. Even when I have diamond or whatever. But. Oh god. Creeper, why are you near my house? Come here, buddy. I can't really fight you if you're in water. Well, we died. Uh, of course we did. At least we're not on hardcore because we don't have that here. So my house is now screwed up because a stupid creeper wouldn't die. I knew when he was in the water I was going to have issues, okay? It, it wasn't... I did not think that was going to work well, okay? I will admit. Ooh, fishies. Ooh, does that mean there's an axolotl nearby? I know axolotls, at least in my other world, freaking give me fish all the time because they're always murdering things, which is great free food, right? Which I mean, we have we have lots of free food in this this world. Uh, in there, in there, in there. Uh, put that away. Let's put our smoker back where it belongs, which is like not there. I'm dumb goes right here so cobblestone fix the hole again you pop you in let's cook our fish thank you thank you how long does this take two seconds okay so we'll just sit here and wait for it real quick take our food Okay, so I want to stop the water from coming down on my house. I do like the water. I just don't want it coming down right on my roof. Let's hit up here and see if we can figure out where to block it at. Um, somewhere like right here, right? How do we block it, though? Uh, ooh, I see coal. Which, in a cave, might mean other things. Come on, what all can we get before the end of the first episode? That's what I really want. A good first start. I know we've already had a death. Ignore that, okay? You know, we, we woke up in this world. We have to learn the rules, you know? It's just, we died. We understand now what's happening, how rough it is here. We will not let it happen again. Okay, I think we've stopped the water. I am going to make the back part flood again so that we can just go out like our back door and then up. Seems like a good plan. But for now, that works. I just wanted the water kind of to stop annoying me. Yeah, let's go. Uh, it's going nighttime. So day three, here we come. So one of the first things I want us to get is a notebook so I can kind of keep track in game of our goals like you know build a cool cool house uh, like I mean like freaking awesome cool that would probably take up the whole series cool um, what else a beat the dragon of course see the credits get a bunch of the achievements that's also a goal even though we've not gotten one yet so I need to make sure that's even possible um, what else? Uh, find something cool, maybe? That would be awesome. Like, 
uh, I know my TikTok has been taken over recently by just like Minecraft 0.0001% chance kind of things. And so something maybe not quite that rare, but getting in that direction, you know, would be awesome. Okay, I gave up on us trying to build our, our thing over there. Wasn't doing it for me. Yeah, it just wasn't, wasn't working out, was taking too long. I decided we would come back to that when we have more materials and are actually set up. Right now, we just need to be getting prepared. We gotta go take out this uh, pillager outpost, right? Kind of our, our short-term goal for the next episode or two is being ready to battle them. We poke our head in a little deeper. We are all of a sudden underwater with a little window. Okay, so it's a nice little hidden base. Yeah, not today. So let's go check out our our friends over on the other side of the island. See how set up they are and maybe try to sneak in and rob them. Or see if they have an iron golem captured that can help us out. We'll just unleash the golem and let him kind of fight for a minute. Watch from a distance and take his stuff if he dies. That sounds like a plan, right? You know, we got to do everything as roguelike as possible. Aha, Sugar King. We'll need that for our book, so we'll go grab that too. Gimme, gimme. Thank you. Push our way in closer. Peek around. Ooh, there's a cave over here too? No. Oh god, he sees me. No! Come on, die, thank you. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, I see there's more coming, run. Oh, uh, if I get sniped by a skeleton or something. Okay, I think we're okay. Hopefully we'll be okay. Okay, that's the golem. I thought it was a skeleton for a second. Okay, he'll run distractions for us. Okay, uh, hey buddy, I'm gonna I'm gonna steal your bed from you. I'm sorry. Get up. Thank you. Sleep, sleep. Thanks. So on night or day three, we almost died. Now we're on to day four, and uh, yeah, that was rough. That was uh, a little rough. Not gonna lie. Let's take these. We can make us some bread while we're on the move. Okay, nothing really in the mine. I grabbed what I did find. We're not going to do too much mining right now. I do still want to try to get a peek in at the pillagers. So let's do our double, double check. You don't see me. Yeah, so there's no way of iron. Okay. Let's try to grab this iron real quick, can we? How do we get down there? Uh, pick, break, cause a collapse? No. Okay, there we go. Iron, please come with me. I need you, my friend. Okay, sweet. We get to finish the first episode out with iron. As long as we don't die, that is. So, give me all of this. And it's a decent amount. So, iron at the end of the first episode, and even some copper. No, it wasn't. Run, run, run. It was not really safe right there. Do, 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 run. Okay, I think we're fine. Everything is awesome. No, he's still coming for me, Annie. Well, we're going to try to kill him. There we go. Okay, so fighting is hard, especially when you have a wooden sword. But, uh, you know, just beat him to death. Bash his head in. That's how, how Musashi would do it, right? So, how we're gonna do it. 
So yeah, hopefully you all have enjoyed our first episode of Minecraft, and uh, hopefully it wasn't too easy, or doesn't seem like it's going to be too easy. Uh, like I said, I am a pretty big noob. Uh, I'm playing on the Bedrock Edition, or whatever you want to call it, right? And yeah, so we are in Outpost Ahead, if you want to look around for me, see if there's anything cool. Maybe give me uh, tips and tricks in the comments. Uh, I will probably be a few episodes ahead of whatever you all do. I usually try to make sure, just in case my schedule is weird. But I always read the comments. So feel free and welcome to uh, let you know have a conversation. I'll talk to you. And hopefully you enjoyed. I'm going to go pop this stuff in the furnace and hang out at the house and we'll call it an episode so see you all back at home okay so iron tools what do we got we definitely need a pick that is the first thing and is mandatory then we need what probably a sword or is that yeah that's probably true right like we have to be able to deal with these pillagers if they do harass us and then third, we would probably want an axe next, but we don't have enough for that at the moment. So we're just gonna hold on to what we got. Throw that in the box, throw our bow in the box, stick, and our other stone axe can go in the box. Our, this stone axe will break in a little bit. And yeah, so that is where we are gonna call our first episode of Minecraft. Hopefully you all enjoyed, and if you did, why not like and subscribe? It is always appreciated and helps me out tremendously. But with all that being said, I will see you guys in whatever we do next. Later. Thanks for watching everyone. If you enjoyed this video, why not like and subscribe? It really helps me out. And don't forget to hit that bell so that you get notified anytime I post a new video. If you enjoyed this one, why not check out this video or this video? And I'll see you guys in whatever we do next. Later.